Hi, I'm Alison Nickel for SquareEye.tv with all the latest from Albert Square. This week, we saw Ronnie play detective to find out just what was going on between Charlie and Roxy. Charlie took Roxy out for coffee, explaining that he wants his marriage to work. Maybe you should have thought about that before you started having a fling with your sister-in-law. Meanwhile, Roxy and Charlie were thrilled when Ronnie started behaving like her old self again. Oh, if only they knew what she has planned for them. Usually, I'd be concerned when Masood has a bright idea, but the Masala Masood stall seemed like a pretty good one at the time. Unfortunately, on the opening day, he was more concerned about finding Jade, and so the saga between Masood and Shabnab continued over her estranged daughter. When Masood and Jane tracked her down, Masood took matters into his own hands and seized his opportunity to take a picture of his granddaughter. Let's just say Shabs was less than impressed and she didn't react well. But could Masood let it go? Of course he couldn't. And soon he was knocking on Shirley's door with the address. Something tells me this won't end well. Just when Shabs thought things couldn't get any worse, she walked into the flat just as Kush and Stacy were about to kiss. Ouch, talk about adding insult to injury. But what about Martin? Here we were thinking that Stacy had her eye on him. Although, maybe she still does. With Kush and Shabnab's engagement party looming, will it all run smoothly? Our guess, probably not. Join me next week to find out.